नंबर थर्टीन थ्री डायमेंशनल ऑब्जेक्ट एंड नेक्स्ट सो लेट्स बिगिन चिल्ड्रेन इफ यू सी ऑन द फर्स्ट पेज ऑफ यूर लेसन यू हैव द पिक्चर ऑफ एन एलिफेंट एंड अ कबर्ड we will try to understand this diagram through an object i don't have an elephant as of now children but we have a nice cow with the help of this cow we will try to understand the picture of elephant given in your textbook so children what is given if you see the elephant from front this is how the elephant is going to look like from front now If you see the elephant from one side this is how the elephant is going to look like and if you see the elephant from up this is how the cow is going to look like right children the same picture is shown about the elephant now children let us try to understand the example of the cowboy If we see the cupboard from front this is how the cupboard is going to look like right and when you see it from one side this is how it is going to look like and when you see it from up this is how it's going to look like now children all the objects which you see around you are all having a three dimensional shape Let us see the problem set fifty one of our textbook. Now, the first one of your problem set fifty one, children. This is how the diagram looks like from front. Uh, let us see it from one side. That's how it's going to look like from the side, children. From one side, and let us try to see it from up. from above see children this is how your diagram is going to look like from up now children this is your second diagram the second diagram as we see from front and now let us see from one side That's how you see it from one side children observe carefully and now let us see it from up See children that's how it looks like from up just three blocks Now children this is your third one see it from front children This is how it looks like from front. Let us see it from one side. Children, this looks very much similar to the first one which we saw which was from front. It is almost similar to that one. Now let us see it from up. children this is how your diagram looks like the blocks look like from up just four squares children let's move to the next question draw three pictures of each of these three dimensional objects a table a chair and a water bottle as viewed from the front from a side and from above so let's start children so now children let us see the table the chair and the bottle from front that's how they look from front let us see them from one side children now we are seeing them from the side from the side see how the chair looks like and see how the stool looks like it is square it will look the same as we saw it from front now let us see them from top children 
children this is how a chair looks like from above now let us see the stool which is the table and the bottle now children this is our stool that's our table this is how it is looking like from above let's see the bottle see the bottle from above children you just see one small round of the cap a little bit bigger round of the bottle that's how a bottle looks like from above now children did you all understand the demonstration in the end we will see all the things together again now there's one more topic given in our lesson which is called as the cube and the cuboid and the pentomino cube cuboid pentomino what are these where are we using them to understand this children i have one box this is a box of uh, something okay so these kinds of boxes are found in all sizes big and small we buy shoes we buy clothes we buy these kinds of perfume bottles whatever we buy children everything is packed in a box so this is what we are going to learn in cube cuboid and pentomino those boxes which are square in shape from everywhere those are called as cubes and those who are rectangular like this they are cuboids and what is a pentomino pentomino in simple words is an open box the name sounds so new so strange so difficult but its meaning is very easy children now children in this lesson we are going to see the net pattern of cube cuboid and a pentomino now what is a net pattern oh this is something new again what is a net pattern it is is it like a net no children it is the open form when you open the box what do you see that is a net pattern let's see the net pattern of a cube first children this is one more box of a cream some cream one more box now children see it is closed from everywhere as you can see it is closed from everywhere now we will see its net pattern when you open it children the four sides just observe the four sides which are forming the four sides from all the four sides up and down right up this is up top flap this is the bottom flap up and down both of them and the four sides that is a net pattern this one children this top and this bottom can be connected to any of the four squares because when you close it it is going to close from both sides so this is a net pattern of a cube interesting no and it's very easy also children let's close and see once again oh the four sides and up and down my box is closed see from everywhere done that's a net pattern of a cube let's see the net pattern of a cube boy very nice golden box children right so again the four sides you can see children the four sides the four sides of a cuboid and top and the bottom flap and when we close it see the four sides right children all the four sides and up and down that's the net pattern of a cuboid i hope you all are understanding and finding it interesting children this is the net pattern of a cuboid these two flaps children can go with any of the four squares remember so do not get worried do not get afraid if these patterns look different from the ones shown in your textbook in the end when we close them they will close the whole box let's see the pentomino 
That's a pentomino, children. Same only. Now see the pentomino. This is an open box. I'll remove the top flap. This is a pentomino, children. See the four sides as we open it. The four sides and only one flap for the bottom. This is a pentomino. Five sides. One, two, three, four, and five. Five sides. So it is a pentomino. It is going to be closed from one side and it will be open from another side. Open box is a pentomino. Very simple meaning. So children, what we saw in this lesson, the three dimensional objects. We saw one beautiful example of elephant that was shown through the cow. From front, from side, from up. That's how it will look like from up children. From up. Correct? And we also saw these three shapes. This one. This one. And this one. In our problem set 51. We also saw how a water bottle looks like. How a stool looks like. And how a chair looks like. From all the three ways. From front, from side and from above. This is what is given in your lesson number 13. It's a very interesting lesson children. And a very beautiful lesson. To understand the dynamics of nature. What we observe every day, every time. Are the three dimensional shapes. I hope that you all have understood the lesson. If you understood this lesson, do give a like and a nice comment. So we are always motivated to help you and make the lessons even more interesting. If you like my videos, then don't forget to share it with your friends and do subscribe to my channel to get the latest updates. Thank you for watching till the end.